Yo, what's up, everybody? This is Jonah, y'all, and I'm back, y'all, with another video and another message and another serious eye open videos. I'm going to talk about nobody in church teach y'all how to be honest. All right? And I'm going to say again, nobody in church, preachers, never taught y'all how to be honest. Okay? Now, this is the message, man, you know, or we already know, man. Preachers never talk to you all type of stuff, okay? And all that do, y'all, just have one comment, y'all. All that just teach you how to keep a Sabbath, y'all. All that just telling y'all kind of false leader lies, you know what I'm saying? You should not be eating meat, deer, pork, and all that kind of stuff. That's such a Brazil false you see what I'm saying? <laughs> For real, man. You know, they not really teach y'all anything, y'all. You know what I'm saying? They not for real. I'm going to say it again. I don't care what people say about me. I really don't give a damn. Preach Preachers did not really taught y'all do anything, y'all. Only just tell y'all you got to keep a Sabbath. You should not be eating pork and all that kind of stuff, man. That's just that's such a Brazier law, you know what I'm saying? And they're not really teaching you how to be honest. You see what I'm saying? And that's the Paul. I just don't understand. You see what I'm saying? You know, and you know, God is God is just you know talking to me in my heart, man. To say, son. People, it's only people just have one comment. You know, people don't know how to be honest with themselves in this life. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, God is talking to me. And I, and I understood. You see what I'm saying? And I just had to do the videos, man. You know, just put it out there. You know, nobody teach y'all how to be honest, man. You know, you know, same thing for Israelites, Jehovah Witness, Islam. Atheists, Muslim, all rest of them, they not really teach y'all how, how to be honest. And this is so dangerous stuff, man. They lead, they lead everybody to hell. You know why? Because they not really teaching y'all how to be honest. Okay? And this is so sad as pulp, man. You know? And that's the reason why y'all been lied to. Y'all been lied by the priests. Are preachers, y'all, but because they're not give y'all no rest and no truth. Okay, you can't talk about uh TDJ, they TDJ not give y'all no truth. You can't talk about uh George Maya, she not give y'all no truth. You can't say um the uh, the uh, beating him, you can't say um uh you know, I me mean, uh John Hagen, you can't you can't you can't say that because all is the same, they're not really teach y'all how to. To be honest, man, honest is a very important, man. Let me tell you something, man. That was all in the Bible, y'all. That's right, man. That was all in the Bible. They're not really, you know what I mean? They're not really teaching y'all how to do things, man. They're not really teaching you how to do the real stuff, man. What God wants y'all to be. All they do just teach you, all they just tell you how to keep a Sabbath. You see what I'm saying? And that's that's false. Everything is all false. You know what I'm saying? It, it's number religious, man. You see what I'm saying? That's the reason why I'm trying to stay away from religious, man. Because religious, man, it's, it's, they lead y'all to going to hell. I'm just telling you what I I'm just telling you what I know. Because I know it's real. Because I'm t that's the reason why I'm taking a stand. What I'm believing for. I believe religions leave y'all to hell. That's why I believe, y'all, because I'm living in the real world. See, that's the reason why I ain't going to church. Let me tell you something about me, man. Let me be honest with my life to y'all, man. Let me tell y'all the truth, man, about me, man. You know, because I not I, I ain't got nothing to hide, y'all. God, 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 God want me to be honest with my life. See, that's that's what I'm doing. Be honest. Let me tell you something about me, man. I'm going to church. I was I go to church every single Sunday. I ain't tell you no lies. You know, I've been in church since I was since I was six years old, I got baptized in water. Okay? Yes, I was. And I was six years old. I got baptized in water. And I never heard nobody. I never heard the preachers never talk, talk 
teach people how to be honest. They not really teach people anything, y'all. They not really teach me how to anything. You know, I've been in church long enough, y'all. I've been in church since I was and I was little, man. Cause my mama, my mama, she's a Christian. She's a religious. You know what I'm saying? My mama's a Christian. You know, but she have a deep and warm relationship with God. But still, she not really teach me how to be honest. You see, that's how dangerous stuff is. Man, let me tell you something. Let me back to me, man. I've been in church, and I was in Sacramento, California, and I was a kid. And now back in, in New Orleans, I've been in church, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, I was in a choir and all that stuff. I played drum set. I played the piano because God just gave me all type of gifts to play the drum set in the piano. You know, this and that. I used to be in the choir, you know, um... I mean, I've been at different types of church. I don't hear nobody teach us how to be honest. They not really tell me the truth, how real Jesus is. They not really teaching me how did Satan really operates, what he doing and all that stuff. They not really teaching me do anything. You know what I'm saying? I've been in the church long enough. And, they, and I, I can see they got a lot of hypocrisy going on in the church, man. It's all church. I've been there. I've been there, y'all. You know what I'm saying? They got so many people out there. They're not, they're not real, man. People are phony in church, man. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? I don't wanna, I don't want to criticize. I got to speak truth, man. Majority of people, man, Christians out there, they are phony, man. You know what I'm saying? They are afraid to go through the fire with God. You see what I'm saying? I, I've been there. I know what's going on, man. I, I know, man. Because most of the people out there, they they number hypocrisy. They number work with nicotine. You see what I'm saying? That you know, I have been there. I've been in church in New Orleans, and and I was and I was in San Antonio. I've been in church long enough, man. But I never heard no preachers talk us how to be honest, and that was so sad, y'all. You know what I mean? I I ain't never heard the preachers and, and, and tell the truth about how really Jezebel really operates, okay? And, the, and I'm going to tell you the truth. I really don't know how Jezebel is, you know what I'm saying? Jezebel is in the Bible too. She's an evil, wicked woman, you know what I'm saying? And some of y'all questions said, well, JC, how do you heard about Jezebel? Man, I heard her on, I heard her on Facebook, okay? It's the dude, the dude, the dude named Dominique, you know, they did I heard I heard one of his video on my Facebook how Jezebel really operates. And be honest with and be honest with you, I never heard nothing about Jezebel because ain't nobody teach me anything, y'all. You know what I mean? I really don't know nothing, man. You know what I'm saying? That's the reason why I'm so hungry with the truth. I wanna know what's going on with the world, man. You know what I'm saying? That's you know what I mean? It's you know what I mean? That's that's the reason why I'm doing some research for myself because Nobody never think about doing the research. I'm the main one research. I listen to the brother named T. Ario. I listen to Deja John, what whatever her name is. I listen to, you know, one of the people, man. Because most people, man, just speak truth. So now God just give me a gift. Because God knows, God knows I'm be searching for truth. You know what I'm saying? And just, look, you know what I mean? He just give me a gift to speak the truth, man. You know? Now back to, honestly, preach. Preachers never taught me, never taught nobody how to be honest. Even my own mama, man. My mama, my daddy, man, my family, never, never telling me how to be honest with my life. You see what I'm saying? That's how dangerous stuff is, man, you know. And they going to hell, y'all. Most preachers out there, Israelite, Jehovah Witness, uh, atheists, the Buddhism, and, and, and Muslim, they they going to hell, man, because they not really teach y'all anything, y'all. They just tell y'all different doctrines of liars, man. You know what I'm saying? Talk about you should not be eat pork and all that kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? They just be teaching y'all number lies. They just teach you. They just telling you kind of lies. Talk about Jesus was born December the twenty fifth. It's okay. You celebrate holidays and all that stuff, man. Everything is all lies, man. That's the reason why I'm waking up. That's the reason why I, I'm doing some research because nobody can teach me anything. You see what I'm saying? So that's the reason why I'm doing some lot of research because I'm so hungry with the truth. I don't care what people say. I just had to lose somebody. I just had to lose my mama. I just had to lose my brother. 
I just had to lose my dad and my whole thing and my friends. I just had to lose everybody, you know what I'm saying? Because nobody don't know how to be honest with themselves. Sad, y'all. Sad. Sad, 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 you know what I'm saying? My mama, let me tell you something. My mama telling me, Johnny, you're going to lose me. You're going to lose a lot of people. My mama trying to put bad luck on me. My mama trying to vince me to think I'm... My mama trying to convince me I'm a, I'm a devil just because I'm, I'm doing video and start exposing things and she called me the devil, called me an antichrist. You see how sad it is, my mama telling me, man. And, and I would look at myself, man, it's, it's, it's nothing but trick, but the devil, it got to be the Jezebel spirit on my mama tell, telling me I was evil and all that kind of stuff. Y'all know I'm not evil. Come on, man. Y'all people on Facebook, man, y'all know who I am, man. You know I'm not evil. You know I'm speaking truth from my heart. You know what I'm saying? My mom trying to get my mama to understand. My mom, she don't see none of that stuff. You know why? Because she got brainwashed by the government in church. You see what I'm saying? She she enters a religions, and I don't. I used to be a religions, but I don't. You see what I'm saying? But, but anyway... Let's talk about honestly, man. Let you know what? Let me tell you something about the kingdom of God today. God look at God looking for the honestly people. Okay? And I'm gonna say one more time. The most high, the, the kingdom of God today, they're looking for honestly people. Okay? I'm talking about honestly chosen people. Okay? Because God loves his chosen people. Loyalty, honest people. Okay. Now I'm gonna tell you what in the Bible. Let me tell you something about Jesus. Okay, Yeshaya. Okay, whatever y'all call y'all call you call him Jesus. Now I'm just calling Yeshaya myself. This 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 Yeshaya man. They picked Peter. You know why? Because Yeshaya knows Peter is honest because he he's a fisherman. He came to catch fish. You see what I'm saying? Why God, why, why, why you shy you pick Peter? Because Peter got an issue. He got an anger issue going on because he came to catch the fish because, you know what I'm saying? And that's the reason why Christ picked Peter, okay? You want more? You want more proof? Okay, let's start with Mary Magdalene. You shy you pick Mary Magdalene because she's a prostitute. She has sex with different men, okay? She honors her life. You see what I'm saying? That's the reason why. That's the reason why Yeshia told Mary Magdalene, go sin no more. God, the, I'm, I'm telling y'all, man, Yeshia sent her free. Go sin no more, okay? Yeshia, Yeshia man, they pick people in the Bible because you know why? Because people in the Bible, in the disciples, they are honest, y'all. I'm just doing what I can to speak truth, man. That's right, man. That's right, man. Now, let me give you more proof. Let's start with Pharaoh, okay? Let's start with Pharaoh, okay? Now, you know Pharaoh, Ramesses, and all that stuff. You know they're evil, you know? They don't know how to be honest with his life, you know what I'm saying? He he created the image. He created the image himself or something because he worshiped the idols, you see what I'm saying? Now, you know he's a false liar, him themselves, you see what I'm saying? He's seeking evil, you know, this and that, you know. He worshiped the image, his own image, you know what I'm saying? Don't get me wrong, y'all. And if this this is the problem in people in church today. They're not really teach y'all how to be honest, y'all. You see what I'm saying? And they're not really telling y'all to talk to God about what you be doing on this earth. They're not really... They not really tell you the truth, you know, to get real with God. They not really teach y'all anything. You see what I'm saying? I'm I'm just be real honest, man. You know what I'm saying? And that's the reason why I'm doing videos to put it out there, man. You know, to open up you people's eyes and to tell you, preachers never talk to y'all how to teach you how to be honest with your life. With your own soul, man. You know what I'm saying? You got to be real honest with your life. Tell everybody what you've been through. Share people your testimony. And stop hiding your secret, man. Because let me tell you something. Satan wants y'all to hide your secret. Oh, yes, he is. He don't want y'all. He, he didn't want y'all to be honest with your life. He wants y'all to hide your secret. He wants he wants you to, to don't show yourself. 
He won't, he don't want y'all to show yourself. The guy is, God wants you to show yourself to be real with yourself. See, Satan, he don't want y'all to be real. You see what I'm saying? He don't want y'all to be real. He wants y'all to be callow. He wants you to be a pussy. You see what I'm saying? I'm going to repeat that one more time. Let me tell you something about Satan. Satan don't want nobody to be honest. He wants y'all to be soft. He wants you to be a pussy. He, he wants you to be, you know, lies. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. You know what I'm saying? And that's the reason why I could go into church because I already know how they operate. My, I, my, 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 my eyes open, man. You see what I'm saying? And let me tell you, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you all. I listen to the brother named Tiara. He always wake people up, man. And that's the reason why God gave me a gift to speak in truth. I don't care what people say, man. You know? And I just had to do the video, man. Just put it out there, man. You know? Nobody teach y'all how to be honest. That was a dangerous stuff, man. That was a crying shame from God, man. You know? Because God... Let me tell you something. They're not going to make it to heaven. Most Christians out there, they're not going to make it to heaven. You know why? Because they don't know how to be honest with their life. And that was so sad. They're not really searching for truth. They're not really thinking about searching for anything. All they do is just worship Sergio Brazier. Dang, Jesus was born December 25th. Let me tell you something. Near Rock was born December 25th. That's a flat out truth, y'all. And I'm just had to do the video, man. Just put it out there. I just want to open your eyes and just see things for yourself, man. You know? And I got to be out, y'all. Peace.